family tonight, animals are taking over a county in Minnesota. But they're not pests, they're pigs, who are actually beautifying and boosting the economy. In our weekend journal, John Lauritsen of our Minneapolis station, WCCO, takes us to farm country, where the puns are as plentiful as the pigs. Martin County is pork capital of the state. It's a sense of pride, 10 miles from the Iowa border. And if you don't believe in the power of pigs, just take a stroll through downtown Fairmont. What do we have up here? This is a pork in the road, not a pork <laughs> in the road. I like that, a pork, pork in, in the, the road. road. Now, don't be surprised, we're gonna use that. Businessman Jeff Rouse is used to bad pork puns. He's one of the people behind this pig invasion. Garbo, that's my pig, was the first one in the county. As in famous actress Greta Garbo. About a year and a half ago, Jeff and others got the idea to put 400 pound concrete pigs in front of businesses as a way to promote the stores, the pork industry, and local artists. We knew from the beginning this would be popular and people would like it. However, when we started seeing the artwork that was done on these hogs, they took it to another level. 20 Martin County artists painted this wine to represent the businesses they stand in front of. It turned out pretty good, actually. It's, it's whoever, whoever painted it did an amazing job. Noe Juarez runs El Agave Mexican Restaurant. And your pig's name is Chuleta? Yeah. What does that mean? That's a uh, pork chop in Spanish. Half a block away from Noe's restaurant is the Opera House. Our pig's name is Nicholas. Um, for a long time, the Fairmont Opera House was known as the Nicholas Theater. Their pig is decorated in performing arts and has a phantom of the opera mask. For us, it's kind of a mascot. <laughs> and every few months, new pigs are born. David Hasselhog is one of 20 pigs in downtown Fairmont and one of more than 70 pigs now on display in Martin County. We had no idea that it would grow into what it is today. I like this one. I feel like it adds something different to see and look at. The only disappointment is that these will never turn into bacon. People are taking road trips to Martin County to take the tour of the pigs. The county is going hog wild. It's like incredible. John Lordson, CBS News, Martin County, Minnesota.